yo, this your boy Tito, aka Mr. Young. This your boy Matt, aka Hops, and you're now rocking with the best. The Hip Hop Podcast. You dig? Yes, sir. Okay, okay. Hey, yo. Hey. hey. I don't know why that was in my head. I'm, it popped I'm just away. Hearing, yeah, I'm just hearing uh, Naughty by Nature not, right Hey, now. it's hardest snare. Why that popped up in my head? I don't know. Hardest snare in hip-hop in that song. Yeah, man. Blue, 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 blue. Got the got a little bit of re. I, there's a little bit of reverb on it. For some reason, that snare hits hard as fuck. Yeah, man, I'm gonna have to go back and listen to it. Like I haven't heard that song in forever. I now, don't know that why that, it popped up in my head, but go it, back it and listen to that snare. Yeah, I'm gonna do that on when I hit the road again. It was like I'm a re- here. it's a reverb plus it's like almost like a ha- like a, a, a bit of a rim shot too yeah. when it's hitting. Yeah, it's like boom boom clack boom boom clack. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check that out. You're gonna be like, hmm, I need to find that snare. I'm going to have to find it. I'm going to have to feel it. Why is it every time, the past few podcasts we start off, I'm always, we're always doing some kind of, like, last, what the last one was, uh, either that or the Ramble, I can't remember which one it was, but shouldn't left you without a dope beat to step to. We just, we just uh, coming in with, oh, with yeah. a song. Yeah, man. I see a theme happening. Yeah, <laughs> it, 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 and it come right, right as we starting. I, I see, don't know. It just pops in my happening. head. I get I get downloads, <laughs> like you know what I'm saying. Yeah, you, um, you have to excuse me. I have to get rid of my uh, my uh, non craft beer. <laughs> don't knock don't, it out. Don't don't hate on me. Knock it down. But in the meantime, in between time, I hope everybody been doing all right. Um, since the last time we spoke, if y'all follow us on Instagram, then y'all been keeping up with us weekly, even where we're not dropping, um, podcast episodes. We are always on there, uh, on Instagram live on Thursdays, Thursdays with Hemp in the Hops, 10 PM Eastern, depending on where you are, just to throw that out there. Hey, I have a good time on that. Yeah, man. Yeah. But, but my goddamn ass was... 20 minutes late to work on Friday. Yeah, man. I, I, uh, I was, I was, it was rough. <laughs> yeah, I bet it was. I and for, that fucks my whole day up. I forget uh, <laughs> that uh, hops. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I had to um, I'm a trooper, I, I, get up a little bit uh, early. Yeah. I was supposed to be at work at 6 o'clock. I got up at 5.55. Yeah. But I still got to work at 20 after. Yeah, so it wasn't too too bad. It was. It's still it, this, the bad. amount of shit I get though. Yeah, <laughs> for me, that was the first time I've been late in two years. Yeah, yeah, and I've been working there now. January will be seventeen years I've been working there, but I I hadn't been late in two years, mm-hmm. and I was just like, ah. But it's worth it. Fuck it. Yeah. I mean, what they, what are they gonna do? Fire me? Fuck them. <laughs> After seventeen years, you fire me for being late late one time in two years. But I, I will I will burn that motherfucker down. Burn it down, burn it down, burn I'm just it down playing. right now. I'm just fucking playing. I'll go to work tomorrow and that some bitch, bitch will be burnt to the ground. That fucking suspect number one right here. Because <laughs> I, I fucking be said it. At it. We yeah. have evidence. But yeah, man, we might have to uh, we'll, uh, figure something out so so it ain't draining you uh, too much. Maybe we'll have to, uh, just, I go live from the page and you go live from yours. So maybe you can tap out early if you need to, earlier, because uh, I know... I think the last episode was like an hour and a half. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That so. might be. That might be. That might be. Uh, yeah, you might be. That might be better. Yeah. Uh, but you know, I, I do like the fact that you can bring your page on there though, because you're a lot more active on yours. Yeah. Than I am on mine. I just I have mine just for a, a reference point, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I changed. You know, I was the beard OVC for the longest time on my Instagram. Now yeah, I just changed yeah. it to MD Hops or what is it? MD. 81 hops or something like that yeah something like that i know it uh, starts with the md <laughs> yeah and um i mean i really i don't really post i'm i'm terrible about taking pictures when like you get a lot of people use instagram they take pictures they you know with family friends and everything i suck at taking pictures I, all my pictures are up here most of the time mm-hmm. um, i take a lot of pictures of what well, in, uh, my intimate shit you know i might uh put up there now and then but for the most part it's yeah, just but you, content it's a it's a potato you know what i mean yeah, yeah. i don't post a lot of person a lot of personal stuff picture mm-hmm. wise now when me and you're doing stuff in my opinion that's business that's business business stuff mm-hmm. 
you know, we post pictures that's going to benefit us in some way. Mm -hmm. So, but you know, I post posting pictures like, you know, I, I don't think I post any pictures of my, my grandbaby on Instagram mm -hmm. because I don't, I don't give a shit if anybody else sees my grandbaby. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I'm not I'm like, Hey, look at my goddamn kids. Yeah. You know, hit you in the face. But yeah. a bunch of, I don't, I'm not one of those people. Um, I don't have to show off my kids, although I'm proud of them. Mm -hmm. I mean, don't, don't get it. Don't get that shit twisted. Motherfuckers. That ain't what I'm saying. And I'm not talking shit about people who do want to show pictures. Of kids. I'm just saying, I just don't do it. Mm -hmm. I just don't, I don't ever think about it. Yeah, you know, I'll talk about it all day. Mm -hmm. I'm just, and if somebody wants to see a picture, I'll be more than fucking happy to show you one. Mm -hmm. Cause I got them yeah. on my phone. Yeah. So yeah. So maybe that's how, what I mean, I take pictures. I don't post them. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, but yeah. I don't even know what the fuck where it was going. I, I, I got angry this morning. Uh, some, but so I, I took me a, a couple of sippy sips and got my mind right real, real, real. Cause my first text to, to Taylor this morning was fuck it. Goddamn son of a bitch. I'm fuck it. Yeah. And then before he read it, luckily I'd send him another one. I said, okay, I calmed down. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I see. I, 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 yeah, I, I went straight. Uh, I let I let my anger get the best of me this morning, but I mean, maybe it was, maybe it was, uh, it was warranted. Just, I don't. Even, it ain't even worth telling because it was stupid, but it was uh, piss me. It pissed me off. Yeah, it's all good though. It didn't hurt me physically. You know what? It didn't. I mean, it hurt my pocket. Yeah, it it hurt my pocket. <laughs> yeah, it hurt my wallet. That's about it. Well, like I was playing, man. At times money unexpectedly leaves that you didn't plan or wasn't in in, in your plans, and it's not necessarily uh peachy clean. I'm happy. Yeah, yay. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So I don't I don't got much. So anytime anytime it's go, it goes away, I'm like yeah. Yeah, man. I'm the same way. So I've been definitely uh better with trying to stay on top and watch it because i'm i'm you know my mind just be going i might spend something here and did something there and i forgot because i don't keep up uh with i guess how you're supposed to well as far as using the card that's why i don't really uh, like using my card at all i i go get cash i have uh set things that come out my account other than that i get i need cash money but you know, going into to to the times we're going into, that it's shit hard. gonna be uh, uh obsolete soon anyway. So I'm gonna have to just be. It'll be nothing physical in much longer. Yeah, yeah. It's all gonna be electronic. They're just gonna be able to. You're gonna be able to. If you can figure out a way to just make it, mm -hmm. just to show it's there, mm -hmm. then all you're gonna be doing is spending nothing. Yeah. You're gonna be spending numbers. Well, that's what we're doing now. Yeah. That's credit. Money. Everything's on credit. Yeah. Everything is just. I'll use. Yeah. You know what I mean? They, you get direct deposit now. You yeah. don't even paper checks anymore. They just say, they just say, this is what you, this is how much you work this week. Yeah. And nothing, then put it in the, put it in your no bank. Ain't nothing on paper. No. Ain't nothing on paper. Everything's quote unquote clean energy. But like, think about that. Y'all think about that for a second, right? You work a 40 hour week. All right. And then you wake up on Friday and you just got some, you just got some numbers in the bank. You ain't seen shit. Mm -hmm. Nobody gave nothing to you mm -hmm. physically. Mm -hmm. They just sent some numbers. They put some numbers in your bank. You, you, your number is higher than it was the day before. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah. That's, that doesn't exist. Yeah. That shit does not. Only thing, only reason that's there is because somebody told you that this is there. Yeah. Y'all think about that for a second, okay? And really, that's the same concept as with the physical. Yeah. Like right now, that shit don't have no value. The only value it has is we're saying it has value. We're still using it and uh, operating as if it has value. But what is it backed by? What is like the questions that nobody's asking, no, nobody think think of uh, about? Like you know what I'm saying? That that's where you know what I mean. Y'all should go with that. And it's, it's the quick. same line. It's around, around the same uh, um, lines because at the end of the day, if you don't have no gold or no silver or something that's tangible, then what do you really have? And the scary part is quick. About quick as they put it there, they fucking take it back. Yeah. And quick yeah. as they can, quick as they can put it there, is they can just take it out of there. This is quick. Yeah, yeah. And you say, "Oop, you know what? We made a mistake. Maybe that's not supposed to be there." 
Take it back. All that goddamn work you did that whole week can just be from free. That's why when I see uh, see it, withdraw. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> that. Let me <laughs> whoop. Fuck that. Before you have any time for any mystery uh, people, fuck that. You you ever fuck you? I've I've actually had um, money get deposited in my account that wasn't supposed to be there. Like they just made they deposited it. It got deposited in the wrong account. Oh yeah. And uh, you know, I did the I did the right thing, and I I told them about it, mm-hmm. you know, and we I made it right. But I could have withdrawn that shit now, like it nothing happened. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I don't want to talk about. It. Mm-hmm. But, that's your but, mistake, but not mine. but karma is a motherfucker. Yeah, and I felt I would. Uh, first of all, I, I do have a conscience, and that would would have bothered me because that might have been some. That might have been me on the other end. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And that might have been somebody. That would have been. And it was like three hundred something dollars. Mm-hmm. That could have been somebody's paycheck. Yeah. You know, somebody could have needed that. Somebody yeah. could have needed some diapers for the kids, or that that could have some been somebody's ramen noodles that was trying to get by that week. Mm-hmm. And you know, so I I can't do that. I can't do that. To, I, especially to somebody that don't deserve it. Yeah. You know what I mean? So that brings me uh, to this shit I was listening to the other day about how. Which I done said it before, but it's just uh, a resonating, reoccurring factor that keeps coming up in my life. It's all about perception. Mm. Um, dude was like, uh, basically, um, this trick or this mind trick where you put your hand in um, a bucket of very hot water and then you put your. Um, right here. Sorry, guys, my phone is vibrating his ass. Yeah. Uh, um, okay, yeah, and you put your uh, hand in a uh, bucket of cold this is, this water. Is, this is a sparkling water. Don't worry about it. <laughs> and um, basically, the trick is to see, like, because it's perception. You know, what I might view as cold, you might view as hot. And what I might view as hot, you might view as cold. And it's the same as temperature is same as that so my point is that made me think of that like you know what i'm saying somebody uh, on the flip side could look at it from the perception of oh this might this was a blessing this was like you know what i'm saying this was my uh my karma because i'm such a good person that this happened because you know what i'm saying and yeah. ultimately it is kind of fucked up and it would like it would make you like I'm I'm with you. I would like you know what I'm saying be bothered. Like, I didn't uh, need it. Uh, time. Worried about like what what does money uh, come from? Like you know, ooh, ooh. but at the same time, you know it's the company's uh, miss out. So yeah. they got to uh, you right. know what I'm saying like. But but I didn't know how they would have handled that with that part. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah yeah yeah. So what if they were like ah you? What if that person had messed up? And put the and messed up the number to the direct deposit, mm-hmm. and and I somehow had they were one number off of my mm-hmm. account number or something, and they I, somehow the universe is aligned, and mm-hmm. and when they wrote it down, they put they messed up their account number and wrote they made my number, you know, like our account numbers were almost like their the account was the one before mine or the one mm-hmm. after mine, yeah. So their number, yeah, just was one number off of mine, yeah, and they put the wrong number, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, you never know. It's uh, but like, yeah, you know, uh, that just made me think of uh, uh, brother right. panic. Um, I was listening to the other day, um, in the occult and all that that good stuff. I don't want to scare y'all guys, so uh, I'll leave that at that. Oh, um, if hey, if Christianity don't scare you, then fucking the cult shouldn't scare you. Yeah, but it but it will. <laughs> <laughs> We've been trained to uh, be, be scared of the occult. And, yeah. and all that shit, <laughs> I mean, alpha men and all that. So. We got we got a bunch of occult houses at every goddamn corner here in the south. But that don't die. But fucking occult scares people. But yeah, it's, up, it's all the a, occult a, in, a, in a sense. Yeah, you put a suit on them. So you have to dress up on Sundays to go to this place and to talk about. Everybody goes in there and raises their hand and oh, so they speaks say, in tongues. But and I shit. find I, I, and this, I don't know if this is a. I don't really. I really nowadays, you know, just because I'm so big on history. And now, and I'm a logic thinker, like, if you even put it in the uh, perspective of, you know, the people in that book going to church, uh, you know, holding gatherings and shit, 
you think they were putting suits on to go, you know, do do spirituality have anything to do with being well groomed? No, nope. uh, you know what I'm saying. So it's a fashion show. It's all it's all like when you start thinking about shit like that. It's like man, I God doesn't a, give a, a shit a what you got on. They were wearing robes and sandals. Man, I'm here to tell y'all, God don't give a uh, pro in my opinion. Mm -hmm. In my opinion, uh, God doesn't give a shit about half the things us humans. Think no, it it's material is it, it has never been a human in my uh, understanding, and in my opinion, it's never been a human. So all these human worries and 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 stresses and concerns that we think that it would be worried about, it has no understanding nope. of it. It's the only thing, the only understanding of it it has is through us, and it's just like. I don't know. I'm just trying to. I'm, the more I learn, is the more I'm trying to unlearn and and let go of all these these uh human um attachments. If that makes sense. More than likely, it's it it, it uh in my opinion, in my opinion, mm -hmm. more than likely, you know, God create creator whatever, you know, because as you guys know, I'm agnostic, so you know, I don't believe in atheism. I think it's ridiculous. You because even the be an atheist, you still got to believe in it. So you're still believing in something. You can't just believe in nothing. You still got to believe in that. To mm -hmm. It's just, it's a redundant contradiction. Mm -hmm. To be an atheist, I'm atheist. I don't believe in nothing. Yeah, you, you believe, you believe in nothing. Atheist. <laughs> you yeah. believe in nothing. Nothing yeah. is something to believe in. Yeah. So it's just it's contradiction. You just retarded. I mean, but you know, humans it, are a walking contradiction. Yeah. Um. So I think. Uh, you know how photosynthesis happens in a plant, right? Mm -hmm. Shit just happens. Mm -hmm. Create, create, creator just creates. Mm -hmm. Has no conscience. It just does it because mm -hmm. it's just what it's supposed to do. And you're not supposed to understand it. It don't need a face. Doesn't have. Doesn't. You. We don't. We. We don't have to understand what anything. You don't have to understand it. Mm -hmm. You know. You. You don't have to have a. We don't need a place to go after you're dead. You don't need that. You just. You, why are we, I don't know what, all this shit is just created, it's, it's supposed to be here, we're supposed to, me and you are supposed to be sitting here, all this shit's supposed to happen. Mm -hmm. It's like the fucking Matrix thing, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's all happened this way, mm -hmm. for a reason, or it wouldn't have. Mm -hmm. if it, you know, they, 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 God has a plan, nobody, has, there's no fucking plans. Well, that's what they were talking about the, uh, in the, yesterday's, uh, um, I don't know what you would call it. I don't, it's not really no seminar. I guess class. Uh, yesterday's class as well uh, about um, the multi multiverse and and um, us. Are we living? You know what I'm saying in multiple realities all at once. It's like paranormal shit. Yeah. It's like universes, multiverses overlapping at that certain point in time. That's why people see ghosts. Mm -hmm. It's not dead. It's not dead people. It's just people. It's just things happening in other universes. And it's crossing paths, or it's, mm -hmm. it's that, those timelines are crossing over. Mm -hmm. And everybody's like, they say, what do you call them? Um, residual hauntings, or, or uh, the non, the ones that you just like. Some something walks through a wall. Mm -hmm. Well, that maybe they say maybe that person there was a door there at one point walked through it, or or there's a door there now mm -hmm. that you don't see. And everybody's like, well, why are they dressed up? And I was like, it, they, it may be, it's not in the same time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It may be, that universe may be in the 1700s. Mm -hmm. And it's just overlap. You know what I mean? I think, well, him, I, I think it's fucking awesome. Yeah, I feel like what <laughs> humans mess up is we try to uh, rationalize and, and bring our uh, level of understanding to things that are way beyond our because level we're scared of understanding. Because we're scared of shit we don't understand. Oh yeah, but it's natural. Yeah, animals are scared of shit. They don't, yeah. you know, they hear noise. They're like, "What the fuck going on?" Hell, me too. Like, like, you know, like, <laughs> yeah, like, what the hell is that? So I mean, it's well, all in nature. It, it's this, 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 this right here could be a three-hour goddamn podcast for me and you. Oh yeah, anytime. Yeah, anytime. And we we'll have we we'll have one one we'll have a special podcast. It'll be a special three-hour fucking podcast. I'm yeah, just yeah, we're gonna shit. invite uh, metaphysical ash on. We're, we're gonna, gonna invite yeah. all the mystics, and we'll we'll make it to where we'll have a central location. Like we'll go down to Atlanta and invite people to come down. Yeah, you know, and we'll, we'll find a spot and we'll have. I don't. We'll have a big. We'll have an or, or an ordeal. Yeah, it'd be fun. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, 
But anyway, all walks of life. In the what, same room, chilling. What you uh, what you partaking in this week, Ooh. my good brother? Well, this week I was gonna get something new, but since uh, Roku and NFL plotted against me this morning, um, uh, I'm gonna I'm just gonna revisit something I've had before. Now I haven't had it on the podcast, but I've had it before, and uh, it's a it's a it's a terrapin beer, and um, per usual. You know, we'll uh, we'll uh, we'll pay some bills. You know, and do that kind of thing, and I'll get more into it after that. But uh, yeah, yeah. What, what 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 are you gonna what are you gonna hit up when we come back? Uh, the strain I'm uh dealing with today is called ice cream cake, I believe. Oh. Let me double back. Let me the yeah, only, ice one of the only cake. cake. One of the only cakes I'll tolerate. <laughs> yeah, is ice cream cake. And I guess the only ice cream I'll be partaking in, unless it's <laughs> vegan or marijuana. <laughs> do, do, do they make a vegan ice cream? Yeah, yeah, oh, okay, well, yeah. we'll talk about that more too. But yeah, man. So we're we'll pop off here. Eat, uh, eat, eat some ads. We're eat gonna some eat. Ads. We're gonna eat some fucking. <laughs> <laughs> eat some ads. Yeah, we some ads. <laughs> so make sure y'all hear that correctly. Eat some ads, and we'll be back. <laughs> we'll be back. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't with you, man. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it.